Do you have the eight key export controls compliance superpowers? My name's Mark Brannan. I'm International Business Development Director with AEB. Businesses are often focused on the bottom line. They're thinking about profitability. They're thinking about opening new markets. They're thinking about in innovating new products. Given that compliance is often seen as a burden to the company and a cost element for the company, Compliance officers or compliance managers are often seen as the sidekicks of a business rather than the superheroes. But when you think about what the compliance managers are delivering to the company, it's very much in the category of a superhero. They're preventing the company from um, violations, they're securing the brand image of the company, and they're making sure that um, they're protecting the company's reputation. Those are very much the elements that you require from a superhero in the business. There are eight key superpowers that every superhero should have. The first one is that you need to have management buy-in. Compliance needs to be ingrained in the company, the company culture. Everybody in the company needs to know about compliance and they know, need to know why it's so important. And that needs to be driven from the top of the business. Without that support from management, you will fail in your compliance programs. So first of all, make sure you have management buy-in. The second superpower is training and awareness. Everybody in the company that has anything to do with compliance activities needs to be fully aware of what their roles and responsibilities are, the reporting structures, what the processes and procedures are. So compliance needs to be trained and everybody needs to be aware of what they should do. The third superpower that every superhero should have is written policies. Your compliance program, your compliance policies need to be written down and they need to be accessible to everybody in the business that is involved in compliance activities. The fourth superpower is record keeping. You need to have really good records so that they support the auditing process, also for identification of any violations, and also to support you if you have any voluntary self-disclosures. The fifth superpower is self-audits. You need to conduct regular self-audits to make sure that you prevent violations and also maintain your compliance program. And of course, it's better to do this as a self-auditing process rather than waiting for an external auditor to come in and check you. The sixth superpower is restricted party screening. You need to make sure you're not doing business with restricted parties, so you need to be checking the official lists. And from a practical standpoint, that can only be done with software. The seventh superpower is managing change. Compliance programs need ongoing attention. It's not a case of putting the compliance programs in place and then forgetting about them. You really need to keep tra track of regulatory changes and adapt your policies and procedures accordingly. The eighth and final superpower is software automation. Software is a great way of securing your business processes without slowing them down. And software can help in a variety of different ways. So it could be automated product classification. It could be identifying the correct licenses. Using all of these superpowers together will ensure that you have a really effective export controls compliance program and certainly make sure that you're an export controls superhero in your business.